I know that uh, you've seen what Esperanza Azteca is. Tell me, what has drawn you to that project in specifically? Well, specifically, we have personally kept up with uh, uh, folks that are involved with uh, the foundation and uh, with the company over the years. So we knew about the project. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the first time that I've been able to visit it, but one of the reasons that I wanted to visit the program mm -hmm. is that despite the you know, overall wealth of the United States, the truth is, is that our public education system in Los Angeles and California as a whole uh, is in uh, serious trouble where some cultural issues uh, for children are concerned, so many of our music programs have been cut uh, radically, and uh, our public education system in Los Angeles uh, disproportionately educates Latino children, and they no longer have the opportunity in many of the schools that they attend to actually take music lessons. And this is a great opportunity to bring the program to the United States and uh, give the children in the U.S. that opportunity uh, that I think 60 some odd schools have here. So what do you think music can bring to the kids, to the education of kids? So I think it's, I think there's the, the I think for kids in Los Angeles in mm -hmm. particular, the benefit is that there, that there are jobs in that business. So mm -hmm. people think of music as just a sort of thing that you know more privileged children may do because their children want them to be their parents want them to be educated and cultured uh, the truth is, is in Los Angeles if you train uh, in the in, in music you have the opportunity for a good paying job it was clear to me today visiting the program here in Mexico City that one of the things that the children also learn from that program is just a lot of self-discipline the kids had color-coded uniforms for the various segments of the orchestra that they participated in. They were all, you know, they were sitting up straight. I mean, there were seven-year-old children that stood there through six, seven, eight songs. I wish my children that were that age could, could last that long. Uh, so music, like sports, teaches children great self-discipline. So Esperanza Azteca is coming to LA. Yes, and we're very excited. Yes. We'll be uh, welcoming the program to mm -hmm. a neighborhood in Los Angeles called Cypress Park, mm -hmm. uh, which is a sort of, it's a, it's a primarily Latino neighborhood, okay. uh, but is surrounded by many up and coming, very artistic neighborhoods like uh, Echo Park and uh, Eagle Rock and Lincoln Heights mm -hmm. uh, and I think it's a terrific location that they've chosen to start the program in Los Angeles. Mm -hmm. 